So far in this course, we've discussed universals, what people have in common. So we've talked about capacities like language, memory, learning, and the emotions. But people differ from one another, and actually in our everyday lives, it's the differences that matter. If I want to describe a friend of mine, I wouldn't say, oh, she has a short-term memory and a long-term memory. If I wanted to introduce you to somebody, I wouldn't say, oh, you know, he has emotions that have evolved through natural selection. We're really interested in our everyday life and how people differ. It's the differences that matter. And, um, and so there's a couple of questions we could ask as psychologists, one of which is the nature of the differences, how we're different. And then the second is the explanation for the differences, uh, why we're different. And there are all sorts of differences a psychologist might look at. Um, some of us see ourselves as male, others as female, others in ways that don't cleanly map onto either of the two. Some people are, are attracted sexually, romantically to, um, to males, some to females, some to both, some to neither. And within these categories, there's a lot of subcategories. Sometimes you're sexually or romantically attracted to one type of person or another. And it's really interesting to ask, why is this so? What shapes your preferences? What's the nature of these preferences? Some of you are happy. Others a lot less happy. Obviously, it varies according to your circumstance. But also, people are, in general, uh, either they vary in the extent to which they're happy or unhappy. And this is so interesting that the very last lecture uh, will discuss this. Some people have good relationships and good jobs and good dealings with their community, and others don't. Some people become alcoholics and drug addicts, um, others don't. When this gets extreme, we call it uh, psychopathology, mental illness. But moving outside the range of mental illness, um, there's just a lot of variation in people. Now, we'll focus today on two dimensions that are actually related to life success, personality and intelligence. And we'll first talk about uh, what these differences are, how people differ, and then we'll turn to the question of why.